Hello, happy Wednesday. Paul is the best for UK here and welcome to another video. This is on the uh, Icon Archimedes, Archimedes system. Uh, Ricos 3 uh, is in the ROM of the computer. And uh, yeah, we had looked at Bug to 1 yesterday. So I'm going to try Bug to 2, see how much it's been improved. So do you remember that one yesterday? That was a bit difficult. I couldn't think, figure out what I was doing. So uh, let's try uh, Bug Hunter 2, see, what, see how that compares to the original game. Might be, could be improved a lot, it could be just different levels. I'm not quite sure yet. So we've got so that looks like Repton rather than Bug Hunter. What's Repton doing on the game? Oh, you fucking just dropped some ton, a ton on the Repton. Oh, poor Repton. So it looks like he's taking over a uh, Bug Hunter in space. Oh, so let's start the game. So it sort of like smashes into a thousand pieces. You can see like the space there in the background, which has now disappeared, and now it's loading up. So onto the docking bay here. So you've got a nice little animation of the uh, docking procedure of the spacecraft. So we're in space or a space station. Right. Okay. So here we go again. Same controls as the first one. Ah. So I can pick this up. Right, so I'm going to guess it's the same procedure. Have some of that. Right, can you press this switch here? Or is it just for show? I think it might just be for show. Computer there as well. Oh, that's sticky keys again. Right. Okay, I've, I've killed the bug, but I'm not quite sure what I've got to do. So let's try going back upwards. See if I can figure anything out. So I'm back through here. There's a spacecraft there. Do I have to go back in the spacecraft? Maybe not. I'll try going this way then. It's quite innovative the way you can like walk on the ceilings and stuff. Uh, quite innovative procedure. I'm going to uh, grab that again and uh, let's try uh, dropping that onto the uh, spacecraft. Nah, it's not done anything, has it? Right, let's pick this up. It's not instantly obvious of what I've got to do here. I should have read the instructions, maybe. So uh, let's go down here. Ouch. Right, let's grab this. Okay, I can walk up here. Didn't realise it. I could. Ah, there's another bug there. Maybe I've got to get in first. So, just get your timing right. There we go. Look at that. Then maybe I've got two bugs, so I can go, I can leave the uh, area. Let's try that. Let's try going to the teleporter and see if uh, it works now. No, I don't want to go that way. Oh, it looks like I've got to go all the way down here just to get back down there. So I'll just follow the path. It'll take us down here. Because you can't drop from the ceiling once you've attached to it. As far as I know, anyway. Once you're attached to either the ceiling or the sides, you can't drop. No, it's still doesn't that I say it. Just drop that a minute. You can't, sure you can't press this switch. I have to go on my own. Nope, not working. Okay, let's carry this again. So, the game's a bit more involved than the first one. Um, you got like sort of scrolly levels rather than static screen which is like a sort of improvement i do quite like the first one though because i quite like the house setting on it rather than in space so i'm not quite sure what i've got to do here no i can't seem to get in the spaceship Anyway, so yeah, that was a quick look at Bug Hunter 2 on the uh, 
the Acorn Archimedes. I don't know if it was available on other systems, I couldn't tell you. Um, the graphics sort of remind me like the sort of same style as Commander Keen on the PC in a way. Uh, but I'm not sure what you've got to do as soon as you've done them two bugs, I'm not quite sure. So let's have just one last look up here. What's that there? Can you pick that up? Maybe? No, you can't. So yeah, anyway, that was a quick look at Bug Hunter 2 on this Wednesday. Have a happy Wednesday, and I'm going to give this one 7 out of 10. So I'd like to thank you for watching. Good.